the fuck? Did I not rest at the bonfire? Really, me? Really? Anyways, I just got killed by the Master Swordsman. It's fine. Or the Sword Master, whatever the fuck his name is. He's cool. If you kill him there, you can summon him for an end game boss that you can fight early. Yeah. I'm not gonna fight her early though, because she's fucking hard. <laughs> like, I mean, she isn't too bad once you're at the proper level, but like when you're trying to fight her early, fuck life, man. Oh shit, okay, I'm gonna skip this guy's dialogue because I really don't give a shit. But, I mean, because I already know what he says. If you wanna know what he says, just play the fucking game and talk to these people. God, I hate that shit. You know, you're trying to watch a YouTube video and see and learn about mechanics and shit and some asshole who's playing the game is just talking to all of the NPCs. It's like, ah, who gives a fuck what they say? Just play the fucking game. It's boring. Uh, okay, so I want my torch equipped. And I bought this torch for a very specific reason. It, it's actually a very useful item later in the game, but also it supplies a little bit of extra light and keeps me warm at night. So, ha, huh, that rhymed. That was not intentional. That was a complete and utter fucking accident. What am I doing? Wait, he gave me his gesture, right? I'm not, like, tripping out here. He actually did give me a gesture, right? Uh... Let's see. Oh, yeah, he did. I love this gesture, by the way. <laughs> I'm a failure. Oh, my God. Why? <laughs> I feel like I missed something. No, I didn't. Okay. All right, so straight off the bat, you can't even progress in the game unless... You used the, the the travel system, which fair enough. They want to they want to teach you that it's there, even though there's a lot of players that really don't like the travel system, un because it they want to be inconvenienced basically. And I'm just like, I, it's such a little thing; it doesn't even really matter to me. Because, like, come on, we all know that it's just, like, I just want to get to the place where I want to go. I don't want to have to worry about traveling all the way back through an area I barely made it through the first time. But there's a broken, coiled sword here and a, and a lord vessel. I don't know what's up with all the lord vessels because we never use it in this game. But the lord vessel was the item in the first game that allowed you to fast travel in by the way and it also once you placed it on its altar you could dump the shards of the soul in there the the lord souls in there and then it would open up the gate to the final boss gwyn spoilers but yes gwyn is the final boss of the game lord gwyn the the lord of sunlight or whatever fuck him <laughs> That's all I have to say is just fuck him. All right, so I want to go this way first because there's an item over here that I'm going to need in a few mins. Fuck you, buddy. Oh shit, the dog got smart. He got wise. Ah, shit. He grew up here. Damn it. Fucking ah! ah! You fucking nightmarish monster! When they look at, by the way, like their facial design, for some reason, it like gives me all kinds of horrible memories, flashbacks to Five Nights at Freddy's. For some reason, you know that series. I don't know what it is about their face. It just does. I can't even tell you which one, either, because it's like, how many of them now? Fucking four or five? I, I don't even know anymore. It's stupid, and I don't care. Oh, shit. We gotta let that guy pass. He's looking at me. No, he's not. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! He saw me! Oh, fuck! 
Crap! Cheese it, lads! Bail! Where is he? Ha! Hey! You forget about me, bitch! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> no! No! Shit! Oh shit! Fuck oh, God! Fuck oh, shit! Ah oh, shit! I fucked up! <laughs> I'm fucking around too much. I was trying to be a badass. I thought it would kill him. But it didn't. It didn't kill him. Ah! Shit. Shit. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Suck a dick, dude. Ah. Damn it. Alright, so we can charge up our... <laughs> I like how I'm just gonna move on like nothing ever happened. We can charge our strong attacks now, too, which is something I really like. That's taken straight from Bloodborne. Um, also, as we kill our enemies, we get covered in this black ugh. Look, see? Now I'm running around with blackface on. People are gonna accuse me of racism and shit. It's like, it's not my fault! Alright? It's just dirt. Or something, ash, I guess, from killing all these enemies, and these guys are fucking turning into trees. That's fucking wonderful. Nobody understands what's going on in this game, and if, with good reason, it's fucking weird. We gotta kill this guy. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh! Oh! oh I did not mean to jump! That was a complete and utter fucking accident, and it almost cost me dearly, because those guys are difficult to kill. So yeah, that one undead right there, it's really... Re I would... Re I, yeah. I mean, anybody would recommend that you run up and just kill this thing before it transforms, because it's a bitch. We'll find out what it... Well, I mean, we've already technically seen what it transforms into. Eudix Gunder did the same thing. The first boss of the game already did it. It had its beat. Okay. So let's rest at the bonfire. We could throw... We could actually do it right now. We could actually just throw down a summon sign and help other players. But we're not gonna, and I'm not even gonna waste my embers yet, because this is early game. Uh, if I was embered right now, I could summon other players to help me and shit, but I don't need help. And I don't need an ember at the moment, so... It's fine. Alright, we're gonna very quickly get over into this corner. And the reason why I said that is because this is gonna be an at Yeah, there he is. This asshole... Starts swinging his lantern around, even though it's midday, so I don't know why he has a fucking lantern. It doesn't matter, because he's going to start swinging around, and all of these assholes are going to attack me. Oh, shit! Oh, shit, I failed! Oh, crap! Ah. Oh. Pulling off the backstab in this game is kind of a... Well, yeah, it can be kind of a pain. But at the same time, I've gotten pretty good at it. I mean, <laughs> the backstabs are a mechanic that have been abused since Dark Souls 1, basically. So there's an item up there, right? Just to quickly change topic. There's an item up there, and we're going to go and fucking get it. Now, the only problem is that there is another asshole over here with a lantern, and yeah, didn't even give him a chance to make his noise. A bit soon there, buddy. You would have benefited greatly by waiting a few more seconds for me to get up the stairs. And have to deal with two of you potentially. But we got the binoculars. One of the most important items in the entire game when you're making YouTube content. Because now I can just go. Oh, look at that fucking cinematic shit! Haha! -ha! 
Ah, my fucking ears hurt. <laughs> I've been destroying my own vo my own my own voice. Of course I'm destroying my voice. Look at what I'm doing. I'm shouting constantly. You prick! Alright. So we're just gonna move on down the road. Jump down here. Do not roll. I tried being quick about it the last time I came to this area and I rolled. And I fucking missed this ledge and I went falling to my death. And what's down there anyways? Oh, wonderful. Death. I forgot. All that awaits you there is death. All right, we can back. I think we can. Yep. Hold on. No, no. Shit. Oh, come on. I just wanted to backstab you. God damn it, you piece of ass. Hey, buddy. Alright, so, like, right there when he hit me and I deflected his attack with my shield and then I counterattacked, you heard a different sound, like a more of a thump kind of a sound when I hit him, right? That indicates that your attack did more damage, basically. When enemies have are vulnerable you and you hit them, you'll know because you're... The sound will be different slightly. Well, well, there'll be a completely new sound playing, rather. I, I should probably stop trying to talk about the mechanics of the game, because I always fail miserably, even though I know what I'm talking about. I just can't ever... Ah! For instance, there's, there's a new, like, visceral attack. Oh, kind of... Ah! When you kick away their shields, you can fucking stab them like that, as if you had parried them. So that's nice. But, we are gonna book it. We are gonna just fucking bail. Get the fuck out of here. Don't even look at it. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. <laughs> just go inferno. Oh. Alrighty then. So we could progress through here. We're not gonna yet. Oh fuck! All I have are 12 arrows! Ah oh, shit! Well, I'm gonna have to come back to this. Because I need more arrows than that. Um, let's have a look, see. Where is it? I don't have any. Okay, so there's an item called a Loy's Talisman, which will stun, which will, and the enemies I'm talking about specifically are the Mimics. This chest is not a treasure chest. This is in fact a Mimic, and you can tell because the chain is wrapped in front of the chest. If it was coiled behind it, it would be a good chest and you can open it. That and there is also supposedly a slight, <gasps> I can see it. Holy shit, if you look really closely, you can actually see the thing breathing, but only at, like, this angle. Okay. Yeah, there it goes. It's moving. Look, see, it's kind of peeking out. Yeah, uh, I don't know if you can see that. It doesn't matter. I'm about to kill this fucking thing. Alright. Oh, God. Ah! Susan! Look at what we have here! This is why I'm paranoid as shit! Whenever there's chests... She hates it when I fucking... Get paranoid in Bloodborne. Because it's because I feel like there should be mimics. Even though there isn't. Oh my god, I almost died there. I got a little cocky. Oh, shit! Alright, I have been dealing with these guys since Dark Souls 1. In fact, these are the mimics in, that are, in fact, from Dark Souls 1.